We're here now with Mr. Foran. He's one of our award leaders for Duke of Ed. So, Mr. Foran, what is Duke of Ed about? Like, can you tell us a bit more about Duke of Ed? Okay, so the Duke of Ed is where you have to pursue uh, various aims and goals in uh, three different fields. So you have to have develop a skill, then uh, you've got to uh, do some social service, and uh, there's one more which doesn't come to mind just now. You tell me. Physical activity. That's right, a physical activity so that you can get more active. Okay, so these are the three things and you have to set a goal which you can be achieved within a certain period of time. And then you start off with the bronze level and then you gradually go higher. And along with that, we have a camp called an adventurous journey. So you can either go hiking or kayaking. So there's a whole element of adventure involved there. And what you've got going on right now in the background is one thing that you have to do on an adventurous journey, which is cook your own food. So that's really interesting because the girls are now getting to play with little stoves and butane and so that's interesting there. And we just had an incident there where a girl was handed a spatula and she asked, what's this? So, so that was, that was, that really was funny. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Hi, so we're here with Miss Nicholson and she's going to tell us a bit more about what we're doing here. Okay, so what our students are doing today is they are learning camp craft and what that means is they're learning how to cook their food for when they go on the camp. So when they're out there, uh, in the wilderness, out in the wild, there's no McDonald's, there's no shopping centres to buy their food, they have to sustain themselves for the duration of the camp. So they'll be taking their food with them and as you're seeing right now, they need to become familiar with how to light the canister and how to cook their food in the pot. So what they're doing right now is these girls are boiling some water Whilst they've got pasta cooking in there, they're using the heat from the, the pot onto that hot plate there to cook their corn. And do you guys, I think they have some tuna as well. Yeah. Yeah. So some of our girls are vegetarian, so they're figuring out today, okay, I need to be mindful of the fact that um, I need to bring some other types of food with me on this camp. I can't just rely on tin tuna or meat. Uh, but yeah, that's basically what they're doing today. And they won't be doing this for very long on the camp, but as we know, it's an important thing they have to be able to do. They need to eat, they need to keep their energy up while they're on the hike. Uh, and it's going to help them do that. Thank you.